Hello, my name is Jeff Grupp, and I am going to put this video out to challenge one of my favorite people in the world, Kent Hovind, to a flat earth debate. I'm a flatter, flathead, flat earther, and he's not. And I've seen the recent discussion on YouTube with him and some flat earthers discussing a debate, and I thought that kind of wasn't going very well. Uh, I'll explain why in a moment. And I'd like to put my own offer to challenge Hovind. We can do any terms he wants, anywhere he wants. I have no rules, nothing. Uh, we can do time, whatever times he wants. He can have his moderator, the whole deal, anything. It can be on his channel. Uh, he, of course, would have to send me a copy of it, unedited. Uh, I just really would want to get to the truth of things. Let me read you a comment I just put on Kent's video. He's got a video out called 718, 7818, Dr. Kent Hoven, Nehemiah Chapter 12, Flat Earthers Challenge Accepted. Uh, he's, I think, uh, Celebrate Truth and some Flat Earthers put out some uh, uh, video challenging Hoven to a debate, and he came back and responded here. A lot of what he said was, okay, if I'm going to debate you, I want to see the map, and I want to how sticks the Earth's crust, proof of the dome, all that. Um... I didn't see a whole lot of discussion after that. Um, but uh, so here's the comment I put it's on your screen, but I'll just read it to you. The comment I put on Kent's video. Firstly, I want to say Kent Hoven is one of my favorite people in the world. Secondly, I'm a flatter and I would, will debate Kent Hoven myself. My FE channel is zeteticism.com. Hoven's stipulations in this video are not the direction to go for a debate. We can throw all sorts of unanswerable questions back to Hoven as well on the quasi-helio model he employs. For example, what does the Graviton supposedly discovered look like? I think I think Hoven might subscribe to an, the academic theory of gravitation. If he does, if he doesn't, I'm wrong. But if he does, then that'd be a question to throw at him. Because um, you know, nobody's seen it. So if nobody's seen it, it's not empirical and it's metaphysical. Hoven would know that. Here's another question, you know, how do the four winds cause the weather patterns? Uh, you know, the Book of Enoch talking about that. And uh, so if he's holding the biblical model, can he specifically explain that? You know, no is obviously the answer. Where is the proof of the water beyond the stars involved in the Hoven theory? Um, we all know that Hoven doesn't have an answer for that. Um, and... Uh, you know, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I think you think of 50 questions. He, he put out about 50 in this video for the flat earthers. None, no, no model. Let me keep reading here. No model is complete. And to give a laundry list of many or all of the unanswered questions of any model, whether the Big Bang model or flat, a flat earth model, the Hoven theory, etc., is not a debate or stipulations for a debate. And it frankly sounds like trying to stymie a debate. I don't know if that's what Hoven's doing, but usually he just debates. I mean, I've got his whole creation series, the seminar, such amazing work. And he doesn't have any, he just says, debate me anybody. Uh, and I'll, I'll rip you up. He doesn't have all these weird stipulations. Um, and he's, yeah, anyway. And so, um, anyway, let me keep reading. Kent, I have your creation seminar series. I have followed you for years. I want to thank you for all your work. You're one of my favorite people in this world. If you would like, or if you would debate me, let me know. And I'll be ready. My specific model I will use. You can know beforehand. This has all the this has all the information I would know. So you can know it all beforehand. Uh, the model, it's developed on my zeteticism.com YouTube channel. It's called the Zetetic Eye Gyroscope Model uh, for Flat Earth. Video 1 contains an error, I believe, in the Solar Day Uni information. Just to let them know beforehand. Uh, in it, the Earth plane is embowed, and sundogs are proof for given for the dome. I'm a pastor and former professor, but for flat Earth, I don't bring in religion, and I only talk in empirical terms. Let me know where to be for the debate, and I will be there. I will be eager to accept all your terms that I can. If you ask me to present a map, for example, uh, to you when nobody whether a flathead or a globe, has a space picture of the Earth that is not composite, that is not a debate term, it's something impossible for me or anybody to provide. 
let me know about the debate. So uh, that's my challenge to Kent Hovind. I really hope he accepts. I'm not going to do a whole lot of trash talking and taunting, saying if he doesn't accept, he's afraid or all this kind of stuff. But that is what it would look like if the flat earth theory is so dumb then it should be easy to defeat me i'm just a nobody i developed my own flat earth model and i'm just one guy it should be easy to beat me so why don't you debate me and tear me to